Good day and welcome everyone, Songo here with another Hero League gameplay, this time featuring Nazebo. Because just before I got to pick, they stole Kael'thas. So yeah. Anyway, um, let's see. Which one? This one gives permanent, so. Yeah, I don't play Nazebo often. I picked it because my teammates wanted it. And because I, we already had a healer, so, like, what was I supposed to do? Yeah. Well, I'm not a bad Nazeba player. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> what I wanted to talk about is the up-and-coming, uh, hero, kill, er, Lun oh, yep, uh, Lunara who's coming out in early December. Looks like they went over, um, how would you say, the Watchtower. Yeah, I'm, I've always been in love with characters that have damage over time. And even from World of Warcraft. So, just having a character that's built uh, I'm gonna die here. That, yeah, that um, is kind of built with damage over time and vision as her main things. It's kind of awesome. Like, I'm gonna go and defend Turnin because they've got a, all of the coins. Actually, I'm going mid. Okay, never mind, she is. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. We must not be late. Ever since... Uh, where should I go now? I guess I'm going mid. Ever since World of Warcraft, I, I've i really enjoyed the characters that could do. Just place down a spell and that be that. <clears throat> and just run away and still deal damage. Lunara em embodies this type of gameplay in the entirety, even coming with its own, um, <clears throat> heal, er, not heals, ah, uh, movement speed buff. Which makes just moving and healing damage even more possible. Good, got her thingy out. So, fighter cluster. So. <clears throat> okay. Don't worry, I'll stay with you, Irondi. Ironda, whatever. Okay, never mind. You're just gonna leave me. I see how it is. Just going to take this mercenary camp so that um, we've got even more pressure down bottom. This should relieve pressure up from up top. I'm possibly gonna die here. No, I'm not. I've got plenty of health now. Oh boy. Ah. Uh, I was saying. Um. <laughs> uh, they are all distracted middle. So I think. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> I nearly. No, don't bring them over. Thank you. Ah. Uh. Well, at least Jaina had no coins. Oh, mm -hmm. Had no coins. So it wasn't that big of a loss. It then. Yes, obviously. It increases the duration of all of my spells. Aside from ultimates. Which is pretty awesome. Yes. 
Don't. 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 Okay. Uh, you gotta be careful of Fala. She can outtrade me pretty easily. Anyway, Lunara is probably going to be my new main as soon as I. Um. <clears throat> as soon as as soon as she get comes out. But <clears throat> there is a the ah uh, the Gara. Why why won't you just let me roam around the map? Oh, I can't contest this on my own. Mm. Good. Yeah. If Kael'thas had continued chasing, I'd be dead. Anyway. Back in the day when I used to play um, League of Legends, in fact, pretty early in my time playing uh, League of Legends, uh, I made it. <clears throat> there were jet forums. Oh. That. Forums about <laughs> about uh, custom heroes or fan-made heroes. Heroes. I'm calling them heroes. Whenever I play here, I'm talking about heroes of the storm. I seem to say champions. Of course I would. Of course. Uh, yeah, we aren't soaking. But doesn't matter. We aren't that far behind. It's also a fact that Good job. I didn't see she took ever expending creep. I should not be coming in from this angle. What are you waiting for? The spirits whisper. Um yeah. Uh, come on, please hit the tumor. Ah, poor little bird man. Who takes that ult? Well, me for one, but not the point. Okay, gonna try and punish her for that. Mm. Don't have Chain Bomb yet, so that's good. Uh, Ravaging Spirit. And now getting out. <laughs> Cannot defend this alone. The Orc really needs to come help. Ah, uh, Leoric is now in danger. that hits a creep tumor. Yes, it did. Good job. Yes. We have no coins to turn, though. Ah. Endless creep. And it's really hard to determine where the hell it is. Okay. Trying to avoid the stun. Good job. <clears throat> uh, I'm out of mana. Freak Timmer right there. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Well, 
we're going to take things of the deep to increase my range to uh, make it so that I'm a tad bit safer. <clears throat> uh, yeah, only 47 stacks by nine, 10 minutes. That's not good. But you could probably tell how well I am doing by just watching. Anyway, <laughs> yes, about Lunara, something that I keep talking on and on, off about very irregularly. Um, like, her Q is a, basically think of, how to say, Kel'Thas's Q, except, um, it applies a damage over time as well, due to Lunar's passive. We should probably be taking mercenary camps, but I don't know if that's exactly what we can do. Let's try it. Last time I played this map, uh, this is a complete waste. I'll say it's a misclick. Yeah. <laughs> Please don't think me a nub. Uh, yeah, we cannot contest that. They've got another bombardment. Let's try and push this down. Ah, just barely missed. Okay, guys. Okay. Uh. Leort? Dude? Can you help? Okay, whatever. Uh, I should probably... I should probably be helping bot, but I'm wanting to hope that they can survive long enough for me to uh, get this fort down. Um, uh, so yes, Lunara. You, like, uh... Kel'Thas' Flame Strike, and the passive, instead of empowering a, an ability, heals damage over time for up to three seconds on the first application, if that is. <clears throat> on later applications, during the same, uh, how do you say, duration, um, it increases the duration by three times, up to three stacks, which makes it a pretty hefty dot, a little hard to use. Um, <clears throat> I mean, to stack up, that is, because of you being squishy and what have you, but. <clears throat> she gets plus 30 per or 20 percent movement speed all the time even in combat and without spending mana okay it should be around around here anyway Ugh. so just sending those out hopefully I get stacks Gonna clear this out for the coins. Hopefully. Do we have enough? Okay, checking everyone's talents. And a tumor build. Yeah, I knew that from. Okay. And Zagara. So, yeah. And the E is a little spirit thing that you send out to give you vision, and you can redirect it. So it's like a moving ward. A season three Evelyn. <laughs> 
Yeah, it dies every couple of seconds after being used. So it is like a season 3 F1 from League of Legends. Not that any of you likely know what I'm talking about. There we go. I'm getting better at this. Let's see if I can find the center again. Nope. I think that's two of them. No, I don't think so. <laughs> ah, let me out. Ah, screw you. Ah. You know, it's really hard to talk about things when you're getting into conflicts. With a character you don't really understand. And on a map you really hate. Anyway. Oh. Yeah. Lunar is probably going to be my main when she releases. I've always liked a damage over time style. In fact, the, the damage over time style of the Witch Doctor in Diablo 3, not Heroes of the Storm, um, is what drove me to buy Diablo 3. <laughs> They're just gonna try and rush it down from full strength? That seems odd. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess... Ah. Uh, uh, well, they pressured us. They are probably going to be taking this. With leaping spiders, I'll probably be able to... Come on, why do you leap there? Ah. Oh. Okay, well, never mind. That's a decent excuse. They weren't even there. Uh, so what was the thing? Something about the Gunnar being lightning? Oh yes. The Witch Doctor drove the uh, damage over time builds for the Witch Doctor in Diablo 3. Or what throw, or drove me to actually buying Diablo 3. It's a full price release. It's really hard to convince me to buy something. I wonder what's giving me the speed buff. Is it, uh, the shadow stock? I think so. Annihilating spirit? Yeah, I need more range. There it is. Nope. Uh, yeah, that's probably game. At least I got turn in. Yeah. Who are you? <clears throat> oh, come on, come on, write it down. It's that, it's game. Uh, yeah, kind of saw that coming from uh, when. Oh, yeah. I had a character I had no experience no true experience with and didn't particularly like oh well i could probably have done quite a few things better and plus me being distracted by talking about Nara off and on very occasionally probably did not help either because my concentration was not on the game uh, anyway uh, have a good day, and, no, have a fantastic day.